anyone who agrees to marry me, I will have just like fully stalked them and tricked them into marrying me. So I think that's a fitting song, like I'm your biggest fan. I'm gonna follow you until you love me. Hey y'all, it's Conan Gray and I'm about to play It's a New. So why do you call me and tell me you want me back, you maniac? Ultimate party song. That's a good question. I feel like every single time I'm at a party and I want to dance with somebody by Whitney Houston comes on, it's like, doesn't matter who you are, doesn't matter if you're like 45 and a male or like 16 and a female, like you just like go for it. Like it's just so much fun. Everyone grab somebody and you're just dancing. It's, it's a good time. Ooh. That's a hard question because I'm still, I feel like I'm perpetual teen angst. Um, but no doubt in my mind that all of my teen angst came exclusively from one girl named Ella, also known as Lord, and that's where all of, all of my entire teen years were soundtracked by her singing Glory and Gore and Royals and, and Ribs and making me feel like I don't exist anymore. Oh, she just, just so good, just so good, and I still listen to the album every single day. I feel like everyone knows that. I talk about her all the time. She probably thinks I'm so weird. I don't care. I love you. I'm going to marry you if you give me the opportunity. On the day that I marry Lord, our wedding song is going to be... Oh, that's a hard one. I can't think that far. I don't know if I'll ever get married. I don't think anyone will ever agree to that. Maybe, maybe it's... Paparazzi by Lady Gaga. Just because I feel like anyone who agrees to marry me, I will have just like fully stalked them and tricked them into marrying me. So I think that's a fitting song. Like I'm your biggest fan. I'm gonna follow you until you love me. Who said love isn't real, guys? <laughs> a song when you're really hungover. Something slow, something soft. Honestly, Slow Burn by Casey Musgraves. I'm all right with a slow burn. That's the kind of song that just like, you can just melt into it. It's the kind of song that just kind of like, makes you glaze over and think about life from a bigger picture instead of just, wow, my head's gonna explode. I love Casey. A song when you're angry. When I'm angry, I listen to Post Malone. And like the, the <laughs> classic, <laughs> the classic Post Malone song for being super angry is a song Over Now, I think from, from Beer Bongs and Bentleys. And there's this lyric that goes, <laughs> there's this lyric that goes, I'm gonna put this bitch pussy in a motherfucking body bag. <laughs> and I swear, <laughs> it's just become this big inside joke amongst me and my friends because it's like the most ridiculous lyric in the whole entire world. Like no human being has ever said that, that sentence ever, at least I hope not. <laughs> Um, but it's just like, it's just like the, the like most fun song to like scream in the car with your friends when you're just like mad about someone that like made you sad or broke your heart. It's just a, it's a, it's such a really ridiculous song, but it's so good. I mean, it's Post Malone. You like, you gotta love him. Little teddy bear. But at my funeral, I really want them to play I'm With You by Avril Lavigne. And I want all of the 13 year old versions of me to be singing in a choir and sending my lifeless body into the abyss with Avril singing. Specifically 19-year-old Avril with me and singing I'm With You. Yeah, iconic. Never forget, thank you Avril. You did a big, you did a big thing for all six-year-olds in America <laughs> who'd never felt an emotion in their life, so I don't know why we were so into I'm With You. Now I have one that's really good. Ultimate feel good song. Um, it's a song that I think I like has been in my life since I was literally in middle school. Um, a song called Doses and Mimosas by Cherub. The chorus goes, to all them bitch ass hoes who hate me the most, oh yeah, I hate you too. And it's just like the perfect song. That's just like when you're like in a movie, you're like, oh, I'm kind of bummed out and like life's kind of getting me down. You turn on that song and you're just like, oh, the bitch. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> so, like, it's like, it's so good. It's just like such a feel good song. I don't care what mood you're in, like, it'll always cheer you up. And um, yeah, it's just like a classic, classic Conan song because it's just, it's, it's helped me through some dark times. Well, my favorite Australian artist right now is an artist called Mall Rat. And I adore her and I've talked about her all day long um, because she deserves it because she's wonderful. Um, but there's a song of hers called Charlie, which I just love so much because it reminds me so much of Texas. Um, but I think that like Australians and Texans kind of have this similar outlook on life of like taking everything pretty slow and pretty chill. And like there, there's just a, a line in that song that's like, I just want coffee for breakfast and I just want warm cups of tea. And I'm like, that's so Texan. And I feel like that's so Australian. It's just like, yeah, we're just out here. We just want coffee and we just want like, a hug and a nice time, so I'm gonna fall in love with. Yeah. Oh, so good. Warm cups of tea, I just might love you forever. I hope you will not me. I think you. I'm Conan Gray, and I just played It's a Mood. Thanks for getting in the mood with me. Oh, cool.